I really wish somebody had taught me this trick before I started working on cars. Here is a Phillips head machine screw. A lot of times these things are very stuck wherever they are, especially these ones holding on the Subaru separator plates. I have a fantastic trick to get these out without stripping out the head because generally, no matter how much force you apply, you're gonna strip that out. Now you only need two tools for this trick, a hammer and a through handle screwdriver. Unlike this screwdriver where the metal piece doesn't go through the handle, as you can see there, this has the metal going all the way through the handle and you can use that as a striking end even though you're not really supposed to. I already tried loosening this without using the hammer and it is stuck in there, it's not coming out. Now it is going to look like I'm doing this backwards and tightening it, but I'm using my front facing camera so that's why. However, we put some twisting motion on this, some counterclockwise twisting motion might I add, and then just strike the end of the screwdriver with a hammer. And then it loosens right up just like that and the screw comes out unharmed and we can still reuse that. I know there's gonna be somebody who says it, so I'm gonna address it. They do make a tool for this. It's called like an impact driver bit set or something like that. I actually have one at work. I just don't have one at home, so I had to use this method and it works fantastic. As you see, I'm almost done taking off this separator plate. So I hope that helps.